Hi everyone, hope you all. This is Coins Kid. Just going to dive into XRP once again. Thank you for support. Okay, big up the Coins Kid crew. Hope you had a really good weekend. So yesterday I said in the uh, XRP video that XRP has always remained in the top ten since literally 2014. You know, since its sort of inception, it's always been in the top ten. And a lot of people were saying, you don't know what you're talking about. You know, XRP's not been in the top ten. It's a scam coin. It's a shit coin. Why do you cover it and things like that? You get all them kind of trolley comments every day. You know, even when I put things on Twitter, people say shit coin. But listen, yeah, I've always said to you, anything that's been around the block and got longevity and it's got legs, you've got to pay attention to in this space. And this is why I do cover XRP. I do believe in the technology. And if you do, you know, you do pay attention, you look at historical data, you will actually see that it has been in the top 10 and not fallen out of the top 10 since it's got in there, basically, you know, and there's been an awful amount of crap that's been in there and never to be seen ever again. So this is why, you know, not financial advice but please pay attention to xrp okay and, and ignore the volatility going forward because it's an amazing tech but anyway uh this is the current um capitalization market rank on coin market cap okay and on coin market cap you can actually get historical data so i'm going to show you going through the years right now you know not to bore some i do apologize but where xrp has retained this top 10 uh, stat right now you know and this is why i believe in the project i think it's a great project and you will equally see as well there's some really dodgy names in there that you've never even heard of and this is why I always say to you you know there's a lot of crap that sort of comes up and tails off you know don't be, don't be sort of fooled by all this it solves this and it solves that and it'll make you a cup of tea and things like that you know all these sort of problems it's going to solve just pay attention to the ones that are making you know big big steps in the space and again you know for me xrp is one of those and it's showing longevity you know and it's been around the block which is something you can't ignore uh, so let's let's go let's look at the historical data here so this is current market capitalization you can see its rank at the moment is six okay let's go back through the years 2014 so this is 2014 uh, this is the ranks here the market capitalization ranking for um xrp uh, wow i mean look at this market cap here 31 million look at the market cap of bitcoin give me a time machine you know and, and this is the thing here you know here if i would have making videos for you i would have been saying it's going to do this that and the other and you would have been trolling the videos and saying they don't want talking about but these things like i've always said to you patience is key you know there's a saying isn't there time in the market beats timing the market for example here with the volatility of xrp going up and down it was trading at 0 0.003 cent just under half a cent wow you know would you be happy buying that price tag today i certainly would be you know will it ever get there who knows but you can see that market cap right there was 31 million so again it was in the top 10 wasn't it so let's take a look at 2015 looking at 2015 xrp actually made huge headway there it actually did a 10x in a year from its 36 million market cap to 365 million and it actually sent it into second place so in june 2015 it was actually i mean wow you know looking to go back there equally bitcoin uh, was doing okay as well that actually lost quite a, a lot of market capitalization that lost half its capitalization because i'm sure it's around about 500 dollars the previous year so let's take a look at 2016 the 2016 again take a look we, we lost a bit of uh, uh, market capitalization and market rank to ethereum obviously ethereum's still there or thereabouts i think it's still second isn't it but xrp was third you know litecoin's still about the dow I, I don't know about that nem i think still there somewhere dash that's in there somewhere what the hell is that? Lisk, I think I've heard of that. Dogecoin, obviously, I never heard of that. Never heard of that. Monero, Waves is still there. So there's some coins here that are doing okay, but they're not necessarily in the top 10, are they? But XRP was, okay? Again, let's go to 2017. 2017 june i mean look at that wow xrp absolutely exploded here didn't it? it went to 10 billion market capitalization from you know just a couple of years prior to that three years prior to that it was 36 million uh market capitalization so wow what an upside there and a lot of people would have got extremely rich off buying xrp really really early you know so right there ethereum so again third place and a lot of these coins I've heard a few of them stratus never really heard of that bit shares what's that zcash i've heard of golem i've heard of that but half of these are not in the top 10, are they? That's what I'm trying to emphasize to you. Your Bitcoin, your Ethereum, and your XRP are always there or thereabouts. And Litecoin is one of my old laggards that I do like as well, actually, uh, moving forward. But this is actually an XRP video. I do apologize. So again, you know, top, top 10, 2017. Let's jump to 2018. 2018 let's take a look third again uh you know uh actually 17 million 17 billion market capitalization it's not doing too bad uh, lost quite a bit of value there but it's still in the top 10 you know let's take a look at 2020 2020 slipping into fourth but it's still in the top 10
2021. 2021, it's lost a bit of rankings, obviously, because it's it's been a bit lacklustre because of the SEC case at this point, which kicked in in 2020. And you can see it's lost a bit of market capitalization, but it's still doing OK. It's still there or thereabouts, isn't it? It's actually up on the previous year, but, you know, it's it's still in the top 10. That's what I'm trying to emphasize. And if we go to today's price section, you can see at the moment it's in six. At some point, you know, I remember back in the day, there was there was talk of it actually overtaking Bitcoin in the previous bull market. You know, if we go through this whopping cycle again, there's always a possibility. And I'm not saying it's 100% going to happen, but there's always a possibility, isn't there? I mean, you can see, look at the, where we are right now. It's $17 billion market cap. Bitcoin's all the way up there, almost half a trillion dollar market cap. It's got a lot of work to do. But anything can happen if you've seen in previous cycles where XRP just explodes, you know, keep an eye on it. But again, nothing I say is financial advice, but all I wanted to do is emphasize to you that, you know, XRP has been in the top 10, regardless of what other coins are coming in and out, you know, XRP has always been in the top 10. So that's something you definitely do need to pay attention to going forward, okay? Let's dive into the charts. So looking at XRP on the hourly time frame here, you are coiling up here for some kind of move. Obviously, this is a key low right now on this zero fib at 03514. If you do start to roll here and come down, then this is a bit of a fake out and you're rolling, okay? And you're gonna to start to retrace. We can't afford to lose this wave one high because if we do, we're invalidating this impulsive move to the upside, okay? And potentially what you might start to do is start to retrace and fall back to this low. And again, if you do start to lose that low, all this is is a correction back up to that high and you're looking to move impulsively down to the stairs. So there are your key levels of support, right? Right now i'll drop a horizontal line on that that's your wave one high at 03364 and this, this is the formation of this new uptrend okay which needs to hold going forward and that is 02876 for xrp so what am i expecting you know but just because i'm expecting it doesn't mean it happened but right now what i think you've got here is a major level support for xrp okay you can see that you're coming down support 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 okay so we're coiling up here i do think that what you did you broke out of a horizontal just there some kind of symmetrical and right now you're falling back to the neckline of support and you're getting really close to some kind of apex there equally you've got this level of resistance coming down and then you've got this level of support so this could actually be some kind of little flag coming back some kind of bull flag the more to do start to zoom out where you can have an impulsive breakout so this this particular pattern here this is some kind of symmetrical triangle that you're broken out of falling back to support and you're looking to break out of okay so this level here if you do start to break this level of resistance this could be a precursor to the fact that you're going to start to break out here and test this one fib and like i said to you if you break this this free high it's confirming that you've got a fifth wave here and these will be your targets going forward for xrp okay so at that point you know xrp could actually get really overextended here and go to any of these targets the maximum target in my opinion for an overextension and, and sort of big big massive push would be around about 44 cents which is a 2414 there okay and that potential green line there which is 050 fib on the macro time frame a test of resistance at that point you start to come back in a large correction back down to this low now if xrp in the future can hold that that's an amazing signal right there that the bottom is in, like I've said to you, okay? So what I'm looking for here is a break, and I think you're already confirming it. Now, this, this particular pattern always has a target from there to there, and you can see you've already broken out, okay? But what you've done, you've fallen back to support of this target, the neckline. So you've broken out just there, okay? That is your technical target at the moment, but you're coming back for the support. So you're getting some kind of break here, and again, this is some kind of flag that's coming back. And I do think if you start to close above this low resistance, you confirm an impulsive move here and the potential that this wave four correction is over. And right now you come up in a wave five. And like I said to you, these waves have subsets of waves within inside them. OK, so let's look for this over the next couple of days here leading into the rest of the week. I do expect that XRP is looking to break out, looking to break bullish. At that point, you're going to get really overextended. And it's at this point, wherever you get overextended, you're going to start to come in for the big, big retracement here. Like I said to you, there is a potential that you you could actually get XRP cheaper than the trading price today because of the potential ABC correction, which will be traced quite deeply to this low going forward. Okay, so good luck, everybody. But what I'm looking for right now is a break of this resistance. Just see, see this trend line. If we do start to coil up here, break it, we're holding this neckline as well, which is a key level support. So you're coiling up. Okay, you could say, you could say, okay, well, we'll draw another trend line. Okay, and like I said to you, you break trend lines, you're coming up. From there to there is another trend line. You can see how close you're getting to the apex of this particular trend line, like that coiling up, okay? Like I've always taught you, it's about support and resistance. A looking glass right here could be if you start to break this level of resistance right now, because you're coiling up in some kind of flag coming back to this low. Do you see that? So it's impulse, flag, 
breakout basically continuation for xrp i hope tomorrow when i come we, we've melted out and we, we're actually up here for xrp okay but again no guarantees take care everyone that's a key low the zero fib down there because if you do start to roll here you potentially put in a larger correction and that has to hold that high just there okay like i said to you to validate this impulsive and corrective moves going forward for xrp take care everyone hope you enjoyed that update stay obviously stay strong stay tuned and remember xrp has been in the top 10 for almost eight years isn't it well, well yeah over eight years take care bye bye